I don't want to talk about it. I'm sick. I'm a big old mess. My cat on the table. <laughs> that scared me. It's hard. <laughs> Hello, friend is. It's significantly later. I have been to my tab meeting. I have written. I took a nap. <laughs> so after I wrote about a thousand words, I could tell you how much I wrote, but then I would have to do extra work. I wrote a thousand and five words in total. So I already had, so I wrote like 700, I guess. So I'm going to get my 700 words in now. Um, it's only like 8.15 and then hopefully I will um, get some time to read because I've got approved for a couple really exciting arcs from Neck Alley and some that have already come out. So I'm really excited about those. <laughs> Hey sexy people. It is 9 o'clock. I wanted to finish writing by 9 and I did. So that's exciting. I wrote a total of 1,866 words. So now I'm at, I wanted to get over the 32,000 point. Oh, I just hit the wrong button. I'm now at 32,047 words. Yes, I'm very excited. I, I think I told you before I hit a major plot point. I think that was last week. Um, or maybe I did it yesterday. I can't remember. All the days are blurring together. <laughs> I hit a major plot point, so we're gonna reconstruct from there. We're gonna have another thing thrown at us. We're gonna have a little backstory resolve, and then we're gonna have a nice cliffhanger. That was my initial thought, like, when I ever, like, had this idea for the story as this cliffhanger. I think I'm gonna maybe, like, read on my nook for a little bit, because it's only nine o'clock, and I want to chill out. Hi, friendos. How you doing? Guess what time it is? It's writing time! <laughs> it's 9. It's 9, probably 15 actually. I have to write now because it's time to write. I was kind of busy today. I had some homework. I don't usually have homework. We're gonna get my life together because it's 9 and I don't want to stay up because I keep staying up. I didn't know that I was gonna be spending so much time like out of the house today because um, I was just like with my friends because I wanted to write more than I would normally because over the weekend I'm planning on being social so I'm like how am I gonna fit this in and I have like a couple things to do. Can't be stressed. I watched this TED talk on stress today. It's not that you can't be stressed. It's more like your like body's responses to stress and stuff like that is kind of just like your body preparing you and it's actually like releasing the same like things it does like to give you courage. I have obedient servants stuck in my head. I don't want to talk about it. It's 1024. I wrote for a half hour and I got a thousand two hundred and one words or something like that and then I got distracted. <laughs> I had no distractions for a half hour and I typed as fast as I could. I didn't even take a time lapse. I was so concentrated and then it was like it was just gone. I was talking to my friends. I was making jokes. Some words I wrote that I really just don't think sounded like my character. And they sounded more like me, so that will have to be fixed obviously in the editing process, but I've resolved some things. There are going to be some more things that are going to get thrown their way, which I'm excited about. And I need to stop staying up late, even though I'm going to stay up late on like Saturday and probably Friday. Um, what am I doing Friday? I don't think I'm doing anything Friday. But I guess, is that what teenagers do? I don't know. I'm not a teenager. I wouldn't know. Hi guys. I wanted to talk a little candidly about how I was feeling today. About writing. Not, not just in general. I'm fine. I've just been really like lazy with my writing. I really have. I've been hitting my word count basically every day and I've made a habit of writing basically every day. It's hard. <laughs> I go and I have laptop time. It's time to write. And then I'm like ready to make a timer and then I'm like, oh, I still, it's, it's only 8.30. I can do this at 9.00. And I'd still be fine. So that's my problem right now is I'm just kind of putting things off. My camera keeps moving. I think I'm getting sick. But anyway, that's besides any point. I just haven't quite found the right balance. And it's just not sustainable, really, to be in NaNoWriMo for any longer than a month. Any longer than, like, three weeks. Like, I don't know. This is not a lifestyle that I definitely want to, like make myself do at all. This, like, I just can't do this every day. I can't write, like, almost 2,000 words every day because I have so much other stuff to do and it's, like, it's almost just, it's just kind of making me stressy. This is a stressful month, um, with applications and it's, I want to be having fun with my friends and I want to be reading and I want to be doing a lot of other things. I want to keep my room clean. It's not clean right now. I feel so productive when I write and that, that's all of my productivity is going into my writing. So I'm like, I can't, I can't clean my room. I can't like study and like do stuff like that. So it's hard 
to strike a balance. I'm definitely going to do a video like after the month is over, kind of like what I plan to do moving forward after I've finished this draft or 50,000 words into this draft. There is um, a lot that I'd like to change about my habits and about how I want to work writing into my schedule, but not in such a forceful way that it is during NaNoWriMo. With that being said, it's 8.30. I'm going to do a 30 minute writing sprint. I've been able to get a thousand in most of my 30 minute writing sprints. For some reason I get really motivated by people just telling me I have to write. I forgot how to speak. It's because I write. I just can't speak. I was so spaced out today. I got lost in the hallway. I'm a big old mess. <laughs> I did it. I did my word count. Yay. <laughs> that was me telling you that I finished my words. I wrote 1,639 words and I'm getting sick. I did it. I fucking did it. <laughs> I'm sick. Hi. I just wrote for like an hour and I wrote 1,000... 395 words. It's also 9 o'clock and I have the hiccups, so I don't really know what that's about. still have 234 words, technically, but I'm still on track. I'm gonna call it quits for the day. I need to get to sleep. It's 9 o'clock. I wish I had more energy, but hopefully by going to bed early, I will get more for tomorrow. I have such a busy day tomorrow. I'm hanging out with my friends most of the day. So we're having Friendsgiving and stuff, which I'm really excited for. It's just um, a lot of preparation and I keep hiccuping, so I'm gonna talk to you tomorrow. All right. Hey, guys. So, I have literally an hour before my friends are gonna be over. I've been hanging out with my friends all day, which is fantastic. Going to write. I'm sitting down to write. I only have an hour, so literally I think this might be the best motivation I will have all week because this is the only time I will be able to write. I'm literally having a sleepover. I've been with my friends and my mom all day. I was really sick this morning, but I'm honestly getting better. I'm still like sneezing and whatever, but... I have my hate on, so I think I'll be okay. It's time to pump out these words because there's literally no time like the present. <laughs> I was even thinking about like if, if people were going to stay, I was like, I guess I'm going to skip a day because I don't want to just be antisocial. My cat on the table. <laughs> that scared me. I wanted to document this because I'm like almost crying. Nothing to do with my book. I'm just like, my nose is running, so every part of me is running, and I think I'm about to sneeze. This. I think I'm about to sneeze. I think that's it. Because I'm not sad. Oh my god. Did you see that shit? And my nose is running. Oh my god. Hot. Hot. I'm so like disgusting right now. I don't even know how to be. I'm crying, and my nose is running.